Hi, my name is Jean Frey, and today I would like to run you through some of the uh, hardware options that we have to attach a camera onto uh, some of our stabilizer systems. So for more detail about the RE stabilizer systems, I would invite you to uh, go and check the videos on our YouTube channel with my uh, colleague Kurt Schaller. Now, uh, some generalities about the splates. SRH heads, uh, Trinity, Maxima actually have the same uh, plate interface. So if I refer to the Trinity, it's usually applicable to the SRH heads. Um, most of the cameras that actually fit physically into the, the, the Trinity or the SRH can be used um, as long as uh, the, the, the overall weight doesn't exceed 30 kilograms or 66 pounds. We've seen film cameras, we've seen Alexa 65 being used with success in the Trinity and also in the SRH. Um, what uh, is interesting about the size of the standard we are using is it's much narrower than the, uh, the, the classic stabilizer systems in the industry. So that has the advantage of offering a bit more lateral adjustment within the ring in order to make a better, a better balance in a system. Most of the uh, products that I'm going to show you here today feature some uh, threads at the, at the bottom of the plate. Uh, which means that not only the plate can be extended uh, with one of the classic uh, universal QL plates, but it can also be sandwiched onto plates such as this uh, GPI Pro plate and used on, on other systems. So it allows uh, the same benefits as with our stabilizer systems, uh, moving the camera away from a tripod or a shoulder configuration very quickly and mount it on any of the stabilizer systems. And I should mention that uh, any new uh, Trinity and uh, any new Trinity or SRH comes with a 200 millimeter uh, QL universal plate where most cameras can be attached to. Now let's talk about the Alexa camera. Now the Alexa camera has its own stabilizer adapter mount, that's a SAM1. It fits onto classic Alexa that fits the, the BP12, so any Alexa that fits BP12 works with the, uh, uh, with the SAM1. It's therefore not compatible with the Alexa Studio or the uh, Alexa 65 or uh, the Alexa M. That uh, SAM1 can be extended and used with longer zooms on, uh, on the Trinity or the SRH. Um, if we talk about the uh, Amira, the Amira comes also with its own uh, stabilizer adapter mount plate, shown here with a, with a rod mounting bracket attached uh, to stick a, a rod and, and motor, for instance. Um, this would fit to the bottom, but also the top of the Amira. Fun fact, the, the camera is symmetrical. So if you need to spend a long time um, in low mode, then that camera can be used inverted with that very base plate. On the Alexa Mini and Alexa Mini LF range, we've got uh, a few options available. Uh, camera is very popular and we decided to develop a, a proper system for it. Of course, you can use the uh, classic MAP2, the, the base plate of the Alexa Mini, with a, uh, the, one of the, the, the QL plate that is provided with the uh, Trinity and the uh, SRH head. You just need uh, a tool, a few screws, and a bit of time. But if we like to maximize uh, efficiency on set, we developed a series of base plates that can be um, released very quickly from, from its own head. So if you're on a shoulder or if you're on a, a tripod configuration, that can be released very quickly and attached onto one of our stabilizer plates. So this is a stabilizer plate um, for the, the CBP system uh, with the Alexa Mini. If we attach the, the top side of the CBP plate, then it becomes what we call a, a SAM2, stabilizer adapter mount, a SAM2. And uh, the reason why we sell both reference is some of our users uh, own um, a CBP system already and don't need that plate. So in that case, it would only require a stabilizer system, a stabilizer plate uh, for CBP like this one. And if they don't own a CBP, they will need both sides and that's a SAM2. 
we have um, a few sizes available um, and all the sizes for Alexa Mini and Alexa Mini LS I'm going to show you uh, place the Alexa Mini or Alexa Mini LF in the center of the Trinity ring. This means you can move around and the camera will stay uh, optically centered and uh, won't show any movement. The plate does exist in a longer version. That's a 355 millimeter, 14 inch long. Um, it can also come with an optional lens support in the front. And it's quite ideal for some setups uh, involving a, uh, a shorter uh, signature zoom or some engineer products as well. We have a longer version. This one is 450 millimeter long and is designed to uh, support uh, much longer uh, zoom lenses which support would actually fall under the level of that plate. So that means that if that plate was uh, much longer it, you wouldn't actually be able to fit physically that lens. That's the setup that I have behind me here with the, uh, the large signature zoom <coughs> attached to, um, to, that, to that plate. So we provide um, a rod support in the front of the plate. That rod support is adjustable, um, top and bottom, uh, offers a support for two rods. Uh, these rods here are 15 millimeter. This uh, product here is designed for our uh, colleagues over the pond in uh, Hollywood and, um, and Canada. We use 15 mil uh, studio systems, but we also have a 19 millimeter uh, system uh, like used uh, here in the background with, uh, with that rig. So the advantage of using a low mode system like this one is that classic lens support can be used uh, but also on the extended roads, any accessories that need um, uh, some, some sort of um, uh, optical centering with the lens, such as uh, uh, ring lights or rain deflectors or even map boxes. So the bottom of that plate also features a lot of 3.8. Last of those interfaces is uh, as some uh, ARRI pins that uh, avoid uh, rotation with all our accessories. Uh, it's a very good place to fit some uh, counterweights uh, for instance, uh, at, the, at the back of here. So one option for base plate for the Alexa Mini is a broadcast plate for Alexa Mini. If you own a, a broadcast plate, that's uh, the plate that is compatible to the uh, classic VCT uh, plates or the QRP1 ARRI, that is um, uh, typically a documentary plate, a sort of very quick release. If, if you use that broadcast plate, then you can also transit to our stabilizer systems very quickly by using a SAM4. So interestingly, that system is compatible to uh, Alexa Mini, but also to other to third party cameras equipped with our um, PCA system. So here I've got uh, the Sony Venice, the, the Canon C cameras, some of the red cameras. I would like to talk also about a, a little interface that we have in the front of those um, of those plates. Uh, we've got two M4s in most of those plates here, uh, and those two M4 threads distance 38 millimeter center to center, designed to hold some of the focus brackets that we have on our price list, but also. Um, uh, brackets like this SSB1 bracket that fits in the front and give you a plethora of uh, interfaces such as um, uh, for 15mm road with that uh, classic 15mm bar console or um, a single 19mm road um, centered like that uh, road mounting bracket RMB6. So we just looked over some of the hardware options to mount uh, a camera onto our stabilizer systems. Uh, for more information about that or about the uh, stabilizer systems or indeed about our cameras, just uh, visit our website, www.ari.com. Thank you very much.